Uh, my name is Mark Anthony Pointer. Um, I've lived in Wanawato for nearly six years, of which just over a year I have spent <clears throat> living in Tahodeid Huntus, where I look after the gardens here in conjunction with my continuing studies of the local arachnofauna here and other biological elements. Saturday I went to visit a friend as part of my birthday celebrations and returned just as it was getting dark. Um, I walked through El Edom because taxis will not take people back here at night to Tafo Dead Hunters. Whilst walking through um, El Edom there were a lot of people in groups and that sort of thing. I've seen this before and I usually ignore it, keeping myself to myself. Afterwards after having passed through El Eden uh, and walking along a dirt trackway towards my home, I was attacked and assaulted by at least two uh, hovens who threw large boulders at my legs and at my head, uh, disabling and maiming, and I would even go so far as to say attempted murder purposes. Um, I managed to scramble up a hill and visit an, a nearby house where I was able to eventually get some help and through them um, I got a lift back to Tacho Dead Huntress covered in blood and bruises and in a lot of pain and disorientated. After which I just rested, drank plenty of fluids and am recovering as you can see now. Uh, unfortunately uh, as a result of this, I mean, I'm very angry and upset by the whole thing. It's not the first time, apparently, there have been incidents in El Edom concerning people being harassed, whether they're locals, strangers, or extranjeros, which is very sad, disgraceful, and dangerous. Uh, I am actually annoyed because, um, on the one hand, the families of those miscreant children who cause these problems and others could do something about it. The government is always preaching about family values, law and order. The other thing is, what annoys me also, is the uh, government is always preaching about, oh, Wanawato, capital of culture, visit the state, it's wonderful, we are safe here. But the truth is, actually, the government couldn't care less, as far as I'm concerned. So long as they had their tourism in the capital and a few places uh, are policed and they have politicians with their police around them, that's fine. I think the mayor of Wanawata or the governor of Wanawata should look into this.